Hello everyone and welcome to my young and restless gossip channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Adam disowns Victor and leaves Newman for good reaction to dad's fake illness. The young and the restless tease that Adam Newman will face a rude awakening this week. Despite Adam's efforts to assist Victor Newman with his diminishing mental capacity, he may soon discover that it was all a deception. YNR fans are aware that Nick Newman confessed to Victoria Newman, but they were both prepared to keep Adam in the dark and allow Victor to continue duping him. However, Adam may pick up on further hints and eventually realize he's been duped. This could result in the aforementioned wake-up call, setting the stage for Adam's dramatic reaction. Adam has always felt like an outsider in his own family, but this will push things much further. Victor duped Adam into thinking he had dementia, while his siblings conspire to have him crash and burn. When the truth is revealed, Adam may wash his hands of the Newmans and opt not to engage with them anymore. If Adam believes the Newmans aren't worth the time and effort, he may not even seek vengeance. Victor's plan could backfire dramatically if it pushes Adam too far, leading to his father's disownment. Adam may argue that he is no longer Victor's son and that Victor should now focus on his other children. It's easy to see an enraged Adam insisting that even if Connor were an adult, he could never do something so terrible to him. It was bad enough when Victor faked his death, but nothing has changed now that he's faking mental illness. In addition to possibly removing Victor from his life, Adam may resign from Newman Enterprises and declare that he is done with the family business for good. Victor has stooped so low with his latest plot that it's only fair that he suffer the price. When it comes to dealing with Victor's awful betrayal, Adam may have a harsh reaction. According to the young and the restless, Adam's destiny could take a very different turn once the truth about Victor is revealed. Victoria and Nick work together against Adam. According to Y and R spoilers, Victoria and Nick are confident that the test Victor put up for all three of his children will finally bring down their younger brother for good. They can't get their heads around the possibility that Victor was just as skeptical of them as he was of Adam, or that Adam might be really worried about their father's health and not have any hidden motivations. Y and R hypothesis. In other words, they've become as insane and obsessed with Adam as Phyllis had been with Diane for months, and we all know how that turned out. Will Victoria, Amelia Heinel, and Nick be able to keep their cool before following Phyllis' wild path? It's not my fault. It's yours. It makes no difference whether they do or do not. Even if they give Adam the benefit of the doubt on this, he'll mess up on something else. Adam's worst opponent is himself. Victoria, Amelia Heinel, and Nick must simply stand back and observe. Y and R is all for one and all for one. Of course, there's still the chance that Victor's scheme may succeed and his newest heinous crime will finally bring all three of his children together. Victoria and Nick will recognize that Adam is concerned about the same things they are and they will accept him as a member of the family. Y and R. Previous results. Even if Victor believes Adam has his best interests at heart, Victoria and Nick will never believe it. For starters, they have Nikki in one ear, whispering about Adam's prior betrayals, which are making Victor distrust his children. Victor had previously been the personification of a trusting soul. And there's Nate in their other ear, whom Victor is also playing by suggesting Dr. Nate is the one person the mustache can trust. They will make certain that Victor is aware that Adam is influencing him. They do the same thing without ever noticing or acknowledging it. Why is Zulika Silver a throwback to we and R? When The Young and the Restless initially aired on CBS, viewers were introduced to Jill Foster, who was then played by Brenda Dixon, a bad girl who would go on to dominate the program on and off until the present day, whether she was played by Dixon, Deborah Adair, or Jess Walton. Audra Charles, played by Zulika Silver, is prepared to do the same. Zulika Silver, A Reminiscence in the interim, the show has featured a number of noteworthy villainesses, including Lauren Fenmore and Diane Jenkins, Webster, Nina, Mrs. Hillary, Curtis, Phyllis Summers, and Chelsea Lawson. They all, however, mellowed out with time. Audra Charles, as played by Silver, is now set to take over that iconic role. This is why. I want it all, YNR. We don't know much about Audra yet, but we do know she has a desire 
and that's usually a wonderful place to start. We're not sure what she really wants. Is it cash? Is it strength? Is Kyle, Michael Mueller, there? Is Tucker, Traeger Street John there? Is that Jebba? It makes no difference. Andra desires, and we're curious what it is, and how she intends to obtain it. Zuleika Silver gets some screen time. Zuleika Silver, speaking of it, has it. We can't define it, stated a Supreme Court justice, but we'll recognize it when we see it. What makes me think Zuleika Silver has it? Because my husband and teenage daughter could care less about my soap watching on most days. Yet, on two different occasions, when walking by the room where I had the TV on, both of them stopped, pointed to the screen, where Audra happened to be featured and questioned, Who is that? She definitely has something. Welcome to now, we and R. Audra has the makings of a typical lie and R bad girl, unless she matures, but with a contemporary spin. Audra's background is unknown, but Silver identifies as Mexican-American. It's always refreshing to witness such diversity in Geno City. The show should reflect reality and society, as well as the audience who is watching, except that it's a lot more intriguing. Mark Grossman's age. How old is he? When it comes to our favorite soap opera performers, they frequently play characters that are either substantially younger or significantly older than they are in real life. That's why it's occasionally startling to learn their true age in real life. In truth, the actor Mark Grossman's true age may surprise some of his fans. News for the young and restless. How old is Mark Grossman? Mark is 36 years old as of press time and is best known for his role as Adam Newman on the hit CBS soap. On February 3, 1987, he was born. In comparison, his co-star on The Young and the Restless, Sharon Case, is 52. His other ex-girlfriend, Courtney Hope, is 34, and Joshua Morrow is 49. What a big age difference, right? Mark brought his mother out on a special date night for the young and the restless 50th anniversary party in March. Mark captioned a series of behind-the-scenes photographs on Instagram, hashtag ER5050 anniversary party with some of the fam. Earlier that month, there was rumors that he and his current girlfriend, Courtney Hope, were moving forward in their relationship. Some observant admirers observed the attractive actress wearing what appeared to be a diamond engagement ring when the two were having dinner together in Los Angeles. Unfortunately, this was not the case. Unfortunately, there was no proposal that night. Only a month later, the rumor mill reported that Mark and Courtney had called it quits. What's next for Mark on The Young and the Restless? Mark Grossman must have something about him that makes him so appealing, both on and off the screen. His The Young and the Restless co-stars Sharon Case and Courtney Hope would not have dated him if he hadn't. Yes, Mark has had off-screen romances with two ladies with whom his character has had on-screen relationships. I hope that wasn't too unclear. In any case, he is one of our favorite daytime television actors. Let's hope we get to see him on the canvas for a long time. In the meantime, let us know what you think by leaving a comment in our comments area below. The Young and the Restless airs on CBS during the week. For timings, check your local listings. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.